village of Huacachina is a beautiful community that's around three miles from the city of Ica in southwestern Peru that's built around its very own oasis. With a name that translates to mean Hidden Lagoon, it has a permanent population of around 100 people. But because of its stunning location, it welcomes tens of thousands of tourists each year. The desert lake itself is often called the Oasis of America and has for a long time been part of local beliefs and said to contain therapeutic waters. According to legend, it's where a princess had once gone to bathe, but after noticing a hunter coming close, she fled and left her mirror behind, which turned the small pool of water into a lake. It's said that she still lives there as a mermaid and can be seen from some evenings during a full moon. But even the magic that surrounds the place doesn't appear to be saving it from its gradual decline. It was discovered that the lake actually is fed by water that seeps out from subterranean aquifers, but then an increased number of wells in the area that have been drilled to access that water has meant the lake has begun to shrink. To overcome this, local businesses have been pumping water directly into the oasis to preserve it since 2015, and a larger, more permanent solution is currently being developed to hopefully preserve the lagoon forever. The Grand Canyon is one of the most spectacular natural formations anywhere on the planet. But while you may think of it as being vast, virtually a barren landscape, there are some areas that are the complete opposite. Within the Havasupai tribal lands around one and a half miles from Supai, there's a series of incredible waterfalls along a stream called Havasu Creek. And the most impressive of them are known as the Havasu Falls. Once consisting of multiple falls along a cliff face, the region is constantly changing. And after flooding in 1910, there's now just one main chute that pours over a 100-foot tall cliff into a plunge pool. The water has high concentrations of calcium carbonate, which gives it a magical blue-green color. And over the centuries, it's been deposited and hardened to form some travertine dams that hold the water in little pools. It is possible to visit the falls if you obtain the required permissions from the Havasupai people. And for a small number that do, the falls are perfect. And there's a couple of picnic tables there for hikers to take a break. Lençóis Maranhenses National Park, Brazil. Set within the Maranhão state of northeastern Brazil is the 380,000-acre Lençóis Maranhenses National Park. During the dry season, this is a place covered in rolling sand dunes. But during the rainy season, it transforms into an oasis as far as the eye can see. That's because the water that falls here becomes trapped in the depressions within the dunes, with nowhere to drain away to. And this creates a series of interconnected freshwater lagoons. As well as being incredible to look at, this phenomenon also sustains a rich ecosystem. It's also travel to the area when the lagoons are present. And it's become such a popular site that around 60,000 tourists visit it each year. Ooh.